welcome back to my channel we're in a new setting new location unlocked aka my living room the lighting is definitely not the best right now um, because there's just like a lot of cool and warm tones happening right now that it looks a little weird but I think we can make this work. Anyways, I went shopping today. It was my day off. I was supposed to get my car fixed. That's a whole nother story that I would really love to not talk about because it was fucking shitty. Anyways, I went shopping and I went to quite a few places. Urban, the Repostle, Marshalls and Pop Shelf, which I have, I've heard of, but I've never went there, and yeah. So, no, this isn't all for me. I went with the intention of buying the rest of the gifts that I needed to buy for um, friends and family, which I succeeded, except for one thing, but I knew I was going to have to order on Amazon because I really didn't think I was going to find it. Um, I doubt Thomas's dad is gonna watch my YouTube videos. I'm trying to get him a Kung Fu Panda. I couldn't find a little Kung Fu Panda, like the character from the movie. I couldn't find him anywhere. Like he is not there, non-existent. Anyways, this is what I got. First thing I got was from Aeropostale. Oh my God. If you live in the Savannah area, go to Franklin's. Best coffee. Best coffee. Best coffee. We, we love Franklin's. Um, anyways, also, I'll do a try on haul, even though I really don't want to. So you guys are really, you guys are really getting me to do things here that I don't want to do. So congratulations. But anyways, Aeropostale. I had went to Aeropostale with my mom when she came here, like, a few days ago and we couldn't find anything but for some reason today they were popping the fuck off like they were popping off like girl this is so cute I love this it's just um oh my god also the fucking oh my god I keep looking at the viewfinder not the camera okay guys I'm sorry this is probably gonna be really awkward but I keep looking at myself anyways I'll try not to look at myself. Oh my god, I feel like I talk too much. Anyways, these are called the Aero Trouser Non-Stretch um, Trousers. And this is what they look like. They have this cute little like fold over that like was really trendy with like the Dickies pants, which I tried to buy, but they just never looked flattering on me. They never did, because at Urban they have it. And I would always go with my friends and I would try every single time. They never looked good on me, it looked bad. So I was never able to do, you know, like the fold over trend. And now these pants show up and they fold over already. So I don't have to do it. And they look really good on me, I was really surprised. Also, this originally was $64.95 and I got it for $14. So. That's a steal, if I must say. Lastly, from Aeropostale, I got this cute little, like, oh, the lighting in here is so ass that you can't even, like, tell what the actual color is. This is just so adorable. I'm pretty sure they have this at, like, Brandy or something. So I guess it's kind of like a dupe. It's so cute. Um, I kind of, I, like, folded the sleeves because they are a bit long. Um, oh, for reference, I am five one and a half, so keep that in mind that's why i'm like really happy with those pants as well is because or those trousers it is so hard to find pants that fit my like leg length because everything is either actually no everything is literally too fucking long there is never like a time where it's too short unless i'm like purposely wanting to wear like capris or something and i'm not because why so that's why also that was a steal. This I thought was on sale, but I looked at the wrong thing. This wasn't on sale and this was kind of expensive. Ex 
expensive in like my terms. I don't even want to say how much this was. Oh wait, no, it was on sale because that's not how much I paid. So I don't know how much I paid. Um, because I did not spend that. The amount that it says that this is sixty dollars, but I didn't pay sixty dollars. I'm pretty sure I paid sixty dollars in total. Don't worry, guys. I, I think I have the receipt. Oh my god, yeah. The total is fifty-one thirty-two. Um, but yeah. So th those are the first items. Next, I went to Marshalls, and the first thing I got was this, just wrapping paper. It has a bunch of cats on it because I'm gonna wrap Thomas's um, Thomas's family's present in this and his mom fosters cats and so I thought that would be really cute and they look really happy and I feel like she's gonna really love the dedication that I put into that um, and it was cheaper than what they sell at Target so I'm not showing one of the things that I bought for my friend Michelle, because I don't know if she watches my videos, but hi Michelle, if you are watching my video, I'm not gonna show you what I got you, but I texted her and I was like, I got your gift today, and I was like, wah -ha -ha, or whatever. Anyways, I won't show you all that, but I finally have claw clips because all of mine had broke. I either step on them, honestly, I, it, that was really the case. I just stepped on them and they broke. So now I have these, and they're just like kind of like neutral colors, but like still a little pop. I really like this like, these like nude tones. Oh my God, on the camera it looks completely different because the lighting is just so terrible. I need a ring light, which I actually do because I need, I need it for self tapes. Then my boyfriend has two sisters and I don't like know them that well. Anyways, I got them socks. So I'm giving like one pair to his mom, one pair to one sister, and one pair to the other sister. Just because like I really didn't know what to get them, but I really wanted to get them something. Um, so yeah, I got these $4.99. Anyways, I don't remember what I was saying because they're kind of loud. But anyways, um, three socks for $4.99. Slay. Lastly at Marshall's, I'm trying not to show comment, even though he literally went inside the bag and saw the item, but I got him this thing. Supposedly, 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 it works on carpet as well, which I really hope it actually does because my mom bought a very similar toy. Um, little story time. My mom bought Comet a little rat, where is it? I don't know, I think it's in my room. But it like goes in circles and Comet loves that thing. He loves it, loves it, loves it. So I was like, okay, like let me try to see what they have. And then I saw that Marshalls had this, which essentially is the same thing, except it's this ball with feathers and ribbons, which I need to hide because he's definitely gonna try to grab it. So um, yeah. Um, and that was only $4.99 as well. Marshalls was really popping off, by the way. Like, they had really good items. Cause I bought majority of my gifts on the on Black Friday, but like online I didn't like go anywhere cause I worked Black Friday. But they actually did have like a shit ton of good things. So if you're like still looking to buy presents, like you should definitely go to Marshalls. They, they always have a great deal. The only reason I don't like going to Marshalls is because I worked there. That was my first job. So I have a love-hate relationship towards it. Um, but they're a good store. Just, just not the workers. Anyways, now we have Pop Shelf, which I had no idea what that was. Essentially, it's low-key like a five below, but it's called Pop Shelf. And all I got, I only got two things. All I got was these two just like Airhead Extreme candies for, once again, Thomas's sisters, because I don't know what they're gonna want. And, well, I wanted to give them candy. That was originally what I was going to give them, just candy. But one of his sisters is diabetic, and so like, I just like, I didn't know what to get. So I just got the sour candy, because he said that sour candy is like, a good, safe alternative, whatever. So I got them each this, so. These are like really good. I should have bought myself some. But that was everything I bought at Pop Shelf. Really cute. Like it was really organized and it smelled really nice in there. I've never been. Would recommend if you want to buy like 
really cheap things for people, go there. Lastly, my favorite store in the world, and literally my favorite store, my favorite clothing store ever. I was talking with my mom, because she came to visit me and bring up my car, and well, like, we went shopping, and we like went into stores, and I was like, I don't like any of the styles here. But then today, as soon as I entered Urban, and I looked, I just looked in the window. I loved every piece of article they have. And it sucks that everything is like $80. First thing I got at Urban, I only got two things. I got this cat book for my um, boyfriend's mom. Comet just did like a whole parkour trick off the coffee table. Anyways, I got a little cat book, and it's like a bunch of little like, it's called the secret thoughts of cats um, and there, it's just like really funny and like it's like change the channel already and like hold up there was actually one that was really funny that I liked I think this one I thought was funny and I feel like she's really gonna like this one it says did she just say no more cat treats and yeah it, I just it Burn. Okay, I tried to fix the camera because comment literally like just bumped into it, but I don't I this that's definitely not where it was. That's not where it was either. Anyways, cute. Last thing I got of this whole haul and everything was the like I have been wanting one of Urban's sweater forever. And like there was this one specific one that's basically the same exact pattern as this one but it wasn't there, but I had wanted that one for months and months and months, but like everything at Urban is like $90 or like 65, whatever. So like I was just like, okay, fuck it. Like I'm gonna get it. I really want this. And so I got this cute little sweater. Um, this little crew neck. Bro, this lighting does not do justice. It doesn't look like any, it doesn't look like that at all. Like, can you, okay, whatever. In the try-on, which hopefully I'm showing you as I'm talking, um, it does justice. But yeah, that was everything I got. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will see you guys next time. And yeah, bye.